previously on Purchasing in Paradise. What happened to your face? Uh, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. I'm not very good at it. So what I love about these suites is basically you have six, they're rather identical. Yeah, it's a nice, beautiful, modern, tropical look. When I met Mabel and her family, they were living in a makeshift home. It would flood when it rained really hard. It was just a really unfortunate situation. So where are you off to now? You have a board meeting going surfing? Yeah, you know, I think the ocean's calling. So I want to thank you guys for coming to this meeting. My hope is because we are such a big group that I want to make trips here several times a month so we can get together and talk about topics that are important to you all and not just listings, but I think it's good for us to get together in person yeah. and not just always via Zoom. We have a lot of great things going on. We have a lot of new listings, you probably noticed. Yeah. Um, and the most exciting thing is we have a new team member, Julian, yeah. who is, we welcome. Oh, yeah. yeah, welcome and you know, maybe- Julian, super excited to be here at Blue Water Properties and get to know you guys a little better. Yeah, mm -hmm. welcome. Yeah, and he basically has a lot. Why don't you tell them about your talents, about your photography, about your mad drone skills? I mean, people I've been working in marketing for a little bit, so I'm super excited now to be, you know, uh, indulging into the real estate world here in Osara. We're super excited to have him, and he is an Osara native, which is hard to find these days, <laughs> you know. So, well, right. we're super excited to have you on our team. And then we're going to Hello, my name is Omar Garcia, and I'm your realtor here at Blue Water Properties in Osada. I grew up in Guanacaste my whole life, and I moved down here six or seven years ago because I fell in love with the surf, the nature, and the people who live here. I invite you to come and meet our office, get to know this town, and enjoy this beautiful paradise that we live in. Hello. Hello, Becky. Good to see you. Thanks for having me. This is pretty awesome. Yeah, welcome to Casa Redonda. Thanks so yeah. much. One of the most famous and unique places in Osada. It sure looks that way. So I have a super special client and um, he wants something as atypical as you can possibly get. So I think that this is probably checking off that box. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm excited to show you. Yeah, let's Come go take in. a look. All right. So welcome to Casa Redonda. As you can tell, it's a very open style. Nice. We have all these doors over here in the living room. They all open up and allow the fresh breeze to come in. So this is like really indoor outdoor living here. Yes, 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 very much so. We have a wow. nice garden space and the property actually sits around two acres of land. So. Oh wow, so there's a lot of space to expand if somebody wanted to. Yeah, yeah, definitely. If someone wants to add a couple of units, that's definitely a possibility. And it feels cooler up here. Yeah, well, that's because we're at 700 feet above sea level. Awesome. So now this very, is incredible. Very high up. And what was the thought process of, of the round house to create a house that literally is just round three story structure? Yeah, well, we'll see in a little bit, but you'll be able to see views from the ocean. You'll be able to see mountain views as well. And of course, it's super fresh up here. So really, you know, you might need to use the AC a couple of times, but overall it's super fresh. No, I mean, I like the space. I like that it has indoor outdoor living. And I mean, this is pretty amazing as well. Yeah, yeah, let's go take a look. Wow. The master bedroom. Wow, incredible views. Yeah, it's incredible. You have a lot of space, but take a look at this. You're gonna wow. like it. This is like the party bathroom. Yeah? I love it. Oh my god, this jacuzzi is for like 20 people. <laughs> yeah, it's got jacuzzi, it's got you know chairs, everything. This is very impressive. And I love all the Venetian plaster that they used in here. Just a lot of cool finish work, you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They put wow. a lot of work into it. 
I mean, this place, this place is bigger than my office. It's huge. <laughs> yeah. It's humongous. Yeah, and you still have these amazing views. Wow. You're even better. Like just one level makes a big this, difference. This covered terrace is amazing. I mean, you even have better views up here from being on the pool level. Yeah. This yeah, is yeah. just wow. I mean, you have literal 360 degree views here. Yeah, and, and here, I mean, you can you can walk around here and you can enjoy just a little bit more uh, view of all the fruit trees that they have. And then what's upstairs? Is there more rooms up there? No, upstairs is, is no room, but okay. uh, there's no more rooms, but you'll, you'll see uh, something really special. There we have. What can it be? <laughs> we'll see. Wow, this is awesome. Yeah. This is amazing. It keeps this is, going. This is place for like a bed at night to see all the stars. So the owners thought about everything. I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> wow, you could have a serious cocktail party up here, huh? Oh, yes. Yes, this is uh, the real deal. And can you imagine with these views? This is so unique. Everything about this property is incredible. And I seriously think that my client will fall in love with this place. I have to get him here next week. Yeah, you think you'll, you like it? We're going to sell it. We're going to sell it. So yeah. I'm going to talk to him. We'll schedule it. And, uh, and I'm going to get him up here. Yeah. This is inspiring. Yeah. All right, first round. We're doing 10 high knees, 10 jacks, and 10 booty kicks. Are we ready? Go. Come on. Come on. One, two. So what do you think about this class, huh? Well, I always think the same thing, that it's tough. But I survive every you time. You survive. Yeah. You're a survivor. You have serious energy, girl. You know it. You need some? Just call me up and I'll give it to you. If I had one tenth the energy that you had, I'd be going like all day like the Energizer Bunny. <laughs> <laughs> Speedy Gonzalez. Thank you so You're much. You're the best, Teddy. that you could come out today and take a look at Monte Perla. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry that Dawn couldn't join us, but I love this building, this old Mediterranean look. Really, really pretty. Super nice. Let's go take a look. Okie doke. Wait until you see these views, Anne. It's incredible. Oh my gosh. Isn't it amazing? Wow. Yes. You weren't kidding. Let's go a little closer so you can see the boats and Okey the doke. surfers out in the in the ocean up there. Take a look. Oh, you can see forever. I know. Isn't it amazing? Can you imagine sunsets here? I can imagine everything here. <laughs> What's Dawn going to say? <laughs> yeah, I can't oh, wait to see. He's going to love it. You think this view is great, Anne. Mm. My goodness, wait till you see the master. Hooray, okay, let's take a look. All right, the master's right through here. Wait till you see. Oh my gosh, isn't that amazing? That view. Can you imagine just being in here, a nice, tranquil, peaceful time in your owner's suite, looking out at this view, seeing the vibrant sunset, what do you this think? This is a great room. I really like this room. Same view as out there. Sunset with a glass of wine in this room. Yes, please. It's nice. Well, I have a little surprise for you. Hmm? Wait until you see the balcony. Okay. Let's go. All right. What I really love about this condo is this charming loft here, and. I think you're gonna love it. It's great for the grandkids or a guest that's coming to stay. Gives them a little privacy, but it's so cute. It you're gonna darling. love it. Isn't it cute? Charming. 
And what, wait, here's the surprise I told you about. Oh, check it out. It's a rooftop deck. Oh my goodness. Look at this. Can wow. you believe these views? Holy cow. You can see all the way to Playa Grande. You're not kidding. Isn't it amazing? Gorgeous. Can you imagine Dawn. just sitting down here with you and Dawn, sharing a margarita, watching the sunset? Yes, I can. What do you think? Love it. I really, really love it. You ready to make an offer? Uh, let's go get Dawn, and I don't think it's going to be a hard argument, so let's do it. Not a hard sell. Yep, Dawn's going to love it. He is going to love it. Okay, and let's do it. Okay. Everybody. Good to see you. Welcome to Nanku. Thank you, thank you. Want to see our beautiful lots? I definitely want to see them. All right, let's go in from yeah? here. Yeah, okay. All right. So, <laughs> welcome, thank you for making it. Thank you. In this beautiful wow. Nosara day. What is this so amazing? Yes. So welcome Omar again to Nanku Eco Village in Nosara. Wow, thank you for, for bringing me here. It's truly amazing. Yeah, you, you wouldn't think that, you know, something like this is still available and uh, it looks amazing, you know, what's, what's going on here. Yeah, this is uh, 25 years of us uh, developing project in Costa Rica and now comes to this uh, beautiful project in the hills above Nosara, about, above Rio Nosara. And uh, it's about an uh, ecology mixed with well-being. So the, the principles of the, the values of the, the village is, uh, first of all, ecology, to be in contact with nature, to be in contact with ourselves, to be in contact with the other, and to live an harmonious life here in this beautiful heaven. Uh, the other principles is surfing, yoga, uh, good food, good health, and other, and other elements that Nosara is offering for already more than 30 years for the people that are coming here. And uh, I think our, our effort, our, our vision is to, to make a beautiful community that is uh, living in harmony in nature and within each other and create together. Wow, yeah, I didn't expect to see something like this up here, but I love it. I wanna know everything about it and I want you to show me everything. Yes, let's go to look at the, the little stream that we have. Okay. The idea is to uh, create also little ponds, natural ponds, so the, the, the members of the village can enjoy these uh, beautiful pools when, it's, uh, when we have uh, water in this uh, little stream. Perfect, let's do it. Okay. Thank you so much for having me. I'm so happy I came here and I honestly fell in love with this project. It's truly amazing what you're doing uh, here and I also know that you've been doing some things for the community. Yes, as, as we sit here under this gigantic Guanacaste, uh, it's good to reflect on our, also our values towards the community and towards nature. So we don't see ourselves as separated or as alienated from nature or from the community. We actually see ourselves as part of the community. And uh, when it comes to nature, we are uh, we already planted 15,000 plants to prevent erosion and to make this, this uh, beautiful uh, food forest. We, we are going to uh, have a recycling center here that is going to recycle. So. Welcome. Thank you. No, truly amazing. And I look forward to, to showing it with, with everyone I know and you know, all the special people in town as well. Great. 